And this is a special story. True love is for everyone. And that's the promise Gurgambe's startup Inclove is making. But Inclove is not just another run-of-the-mill dating app. It's focused on differently abled. And CNBC TV 80's Adit Charlie and Arundhati Ramanan bring us this report. Sumant KV is Karnataka's first candidate to make it to an IIM institute despite being born with cerebral palsy. His friend Srilata KS was crowned Miss Wheelchair India last year and both their social lives have become a lot more active in the last few weeks thanks to 11-month-old dating app called Inclove that's short for inclusive love. With other apps, I, used to, I had to explain every time uh, whether I'm a different person and how I am different. Okay, So in Inclove, that doesn't happen. Because we like to talk normal. We don't want to talk about the disability all the time. I have met a few interesting people through this app. What I like the most is, as Sridhar was mentioning, we need not have to explain what our weaknesses are. Inclove began as an offline dating agency but quickly metamorphosed into an app-based platform so it could reach out to more users. Today, the app has around 6,000 users. But this platform is not exclusively for the differently abled and Team Inclove takes credit for about 8 to 10 marriages within its user base. I'll tell you about this one story, uh, about this one of the users who had signed up early on uh, back in January. And uh, I had spoken to her for two days to get her on the app and uh, she had been looking for a match for the last eight years now and uh, she said that you know i don't think this will work for me anymore that that marriage is not an option for her and within the first 10 days of the launch of the app she called me back and she told me that you know i think i found uh, uh, somebody on the app and our parents are going to meet uh, in a week and they met and within three months uh, they got married Inclove also organizes offline meetups where users can meet each other with their family in tow. Social spaces, as Team Inclove like to call these events, take place at venues with wheelchair access and even provide extra assistance like sign language interpreters. The company plans to conduct 100 social spaces across India by end 2017. Uh, people who were speaking on the app or who were talking on the app were not meeting in person. So we, when we went to ask what is wrong, they said that either the cafes were not accessible or you know they didn't have ramps or they didn't have their menu card in Braille or the staff didn't know sign language. So there were so many uh, you know hindrances in going and meeting in person or having a, having a good day. These attempts have been well received and both Srilata and Sumanth are looking forward to a time when the India of tomorrow becomes more inclusive. And that means restaurants, washrooms and railway stations that cater to the needs of the differently abled. With other Charlie in Bengaluru, in Mumbai, Arundhati Ramanan.